Well, dang, we snagged a table at Le Cellier. We've never been here before. So this is gonna be kind of cool. Never been here? All right, let's do this. Nice fixtures, nice hallway. This is not La Hall in France. This is Le Cellier. This is down in the cellar. Mm, looks like we're table is ready, so we're gonna head this way. We've got this nice table here in the center. Ooh. I'm gonna say it is pretty fancy in here. Look at the way they set up our like things. That is art. Here's the menu. You can look at it online because it probably changes. They got appetizers, poutines, enhancements, entrees, and like featured wines in here. So we're gonna share the ribeye steak. We're also gonna get the Le Cellier signature protein. And we might do an enhancement. I think I like the sound of the maple whiskey glazed Brussels sprouts. There's a drink menu as well, cocktails and whatnot, probably. They have like your basic like magical beacon cocktails and the iridescent celebration stuff, uh, mocktails, but they also have some other things in here. Oh, a Canadian whiskey flight? Ah, dang it. Maybe I'll do a beer, right? Because you got your Le Fin du Mont, you got your Maldives, your Blanche de Chambly, and your Trappistoles from Un Unibrew. Unibrew? I don't know how to say it, but those are actually really good. I'm a big fan of Le Fin du Mont in particular, so I might... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a Le Fin du Mont. I'll do a Le Fin. Thing. Oh yeah, that looks real good. Oh. Mm. oh man, that's gonna be so delicious. Oh, and we opted for the Brussels sprouts. It's pretty dark, so it's hard to tell, but we also got some, oh, mac and cheese here. And there's JR's steak here. He got the, what is that? New York strip. New York strip. Oh yeah, that does look really good. Nicely done, JR. He's stoked. He loves a good, nice, fancy steak. He's a fancy steak guy. So anyways, yeah, we're gonna eat some of this stuff and it's probably gonna be pretty delicious. All right, Le Cellier, that was actually fairly delicious. First time there in Canada. Gotta say, you did not disappoint. That was a delicious meal. That steak was so succulent. It wasn't the tenderest steak, but it was fine. Like it tasted delicious, like the flavoring and the crustiness and the, the way it was cooked, like all delicious and all the sides were fantastic the bread was delicious the water was refreshing to a lot of people so we're gonna go right through that and uh i think we're gonna go to the riviera the vlog continues yes anyways we thought that a cool place to come hang out would be the riviera resort because it is nice it's got a nice vibe to it very relaxing it's got like the french riviera vibe right so it makes you you know feel like you're somewhere nice, fancy, exotic. Plus there's so many cool places to have your, your picture taken where it looks just nice and picturesque. That behind Jessica is the Caribbean Resort, which is really fun also and neat. It is cool just being here. It's really all it takes. Yeah, you run, you run. Anyways, so yeah, we're just kind of just moseying around enjoying the peace and quiet. So there is some places you can find peace and quiet here at times, but we, uh, we're making our way over to the Skyliner to go back, back to our hotel. Take a little break, pit stop, if you will. 
You see the Skyliner station there in the background. Skyliner does not go to our hotel, so we're going to take it over to Hollywood Studios, grab a bus, then the bus will take us to our hotel. Port Orleans, French Quarter. Man, it looks really, the sky looks really pretty today. Like the weather is downright perfect. All right, no cars coming, left to right. We are safe to cross. But anyways, hope you enjoyed coming along this little vlog type video, maybe. We'll see you guys in the next one. As far as we're concerned, yeah. That's pretty cool.